Brand new features in Safari 7. This features are referred to Mac OS 10.9. Safari 7's major improvements focus on three main areas the sidebar, security, and plugin activity. First is the new sidebar, which improves access to your bookmarks, along with specific articles of interest that you temporarily add to the reading list. Your reading list, which saves pages for offline viewing, and links to articles shared on social networks. Twitter and Facebook are also integrated for you to keep the interesting links shared by your friends and colleagues. The sidebar displays your bookmarks. This grid previews the front page of your most visited sites. This has been part of Safari for a while, but its appearance has been neatened. Rearrange things by dragging them, or drag a site icon, or a bookmark, to replace the sites you want to see. Under General in Safari's preferences you can choose how many sites appear here. Password security is a perennial concern. Like older versions, Safari 7 can store your passwords, so you don't have to remember them. But you also no longer have to spend time trying to think up on a strong password now that Safari 7 actually generates them for you. It can sync passwords between your Mac, iPhone, iPod Touch and iPad, so you never have to bother to type them again. Safari 7 cracks down on the activity of plugins, with a new built-in ability to block them, either for selected sites or for all of them. In Safari Preferences, click Security, and then the Manage Website Settings button. Select a plugin to see which sites are currently using it. You can set a default for all sites at the bottom, and overwrite it for currently open sites in the list above. That's backed up with an energy saving feature that stops demanding, but secondary content on pages, unnecessarily draining a MacBook's battery. The Stop Plugins to Save Power setting, under the Advanced pane, replaces demanding content. This because it suspects why you've visited a page with a static image. Roll over an image to confirm this occurred. Click to play the content. Click Details next to the setting to revoke permissions. And this was the most important features in the new version of Safari 7, OS 10.9, Mavericks. As each new version of Safari, it's always intriguing to see which new features are designed to make web browsing easier.